Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and this is to address one of the common problems or error codes that people have upgrading to 21H1 and it has to do with the lack of disk space uh, when you get that error message. So somebody came up and said well I get this code 0x C1900101. So once again, it's 0XC1900101. And by the way, if you're watching this video and you have a different error code than what I just mentioned, don't watch this video because it's not going to help you. This is for this specific error code that I tell you here. So when you get that code, it is simply an error code that says um, you are. You, have, you don't have enough space on the hard drive for me to install. You need 20 gigabytes of space for the install process. Once it's done, that space will free up again. But you do need at least 20 gigabytes of space to install 21H1. And if you don't meet this requirement, you will see the error code 0XC1900101. So what do you do? Well two ways that you can actually free up space. The first one, go into your apps on your computer. So you can go into all settings and apps and check the list of apps that you have installed, how much space you can free from here. That's one of the things you can do. Um, you know, it's time to do a cleanup often when we move to another version. So maybe you have apps that take a lot of space in here that you don't need anymore. You can also temporarily uh, remove apps and reinstall them later. The other thing you could do is go into settings, go into system and storage. And here, look at how much space each, um, you know, each apps and each uh, folders take on the hard drive. One of the particular places you can free up space is look at temporary files. So here in my case, it says that I've got a lot of temporary files that I can remove, including downloads and stuff like that. So you can actually free up space by checking out what you have. So here, for example, I have Windows Update Cleanup that takes eight gigabytes. You can remove that. There's already check marks on some of the spaces where removing the files is going to be OK. So you can actually do that and clean up and you'll click remove files here it says total selected right now 8.86 gigabyte and so check out what takes a lot of space and you know try to free as much so that you get above the 20 gigabyte limit on your hard drive once that is done if you restart a windows 10 21 h1 upgrade you'll see that it's going to go through and it's going to work fine it's really related to the uh, amount of space on your hard drive. So once again, um, 0XC1900101 is the error code for disk space is too low to actually install 21H1. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.